Hey everyone, it's Melissa from Bee in the Bear Backyard Homestead here in Central Valley of California, Zone 9B. And I'm in the front yard. Um, I'm going to show you guys what's going on here in the front garden. This is mostly just pots, but I do have an in-ground garden that I started, so I guess I'll go ahead and show you. So, over here, I just got all of these uh, terracotta pots from my friend. Uh, she gave them to me. They were in her father-in-law's backyard of his new house and he didn't want them so this is what I'm gonna do I was just going over like some grouping I haven't put them in the pots yet but I think I like how this looks so anyways here's more pots and I have two in the backyard too that I'll show you later on uh, in another video so anyways I'm thinking about pulling these out and putting them in some of those terracotta pots over there and selling them um, these aloes just to make a little extra money. Here's my garlic chives looking really good and healthy. So I planted some strawberry crowns in here like a month ago. Nothing. Hasn't come up at all. <laughs> I don't know if I did it right. Uh, this is my uh, thyme. It's starting to bud. Over here I just planted some uh, holy basil seeds. Uh, Madison really likes holy basil tea, so I'm trying to grow as much as I can because I could not find it anywhere. Here is a tomato. I forgot what kind, but it's doing well. Here's another tomato. These are all tomatoes that I grew from seed. Here's some of my succulents. And here is my peppermint. I had actually had it in a different pot, but the pots were terrible. They didn't drain well. And so I moved over here, and it's doing really good. Those are my bulbs. They're dying out. They'll come back next year. Um, here is my uh, parsley. Uh, this is the flat leaf parsley, and it's going to seed because it's going to be hot here soon. So, And then all my cilantro went to seed, and I'm okay with that because I'm going to harvest all the seeds for coriander. And here's another one of my succul succulents. I just up-potted it yesterday. Looking pretty good. Oh, here's a weed in here. I was pulling weeds. I also planted some more holy basil in this pot. There's some regular basil I got at the nursery yesterday, along with some oregano. Here's the sage I grew from seed. And then in here, oops, is some fennel that got chewed back and then I'm not sure what this is. I'm just going to pull it out because I know I didn't plant that there. And so hopefully the fennel will come back. Another one of my succulents that is coming back. Uh, the frost, late frost really had a, gave it a problem but it's starting to come back slowly. My geraniums are looking beautiful. Here's my bay leaf. It's looking pretty good. Um, I'm going to up-pot that into a bigger pot as well. Here's some more tomatoes. These are all from seed that I grew. Here's the rest of my tomatoes that I grew from seed and peppers. I might, when I uh, put those aloes for sale, I might also sell some of these because I really don't have any more space. <laughs> I have some more grow bags and I'll show you the grow bags here in a minute. And I might plant these two Craig jalapenos in there, um, but we'll see. Like I said, rosemary, beautiful, looking really good, smells amazing. I love the smell of rosemary. Mm. Roses are looking good. We've had a lot of blooms. We have a few more up here. I really like this one. I like all of my roses. <laughs> Oh, this one, beautiful, and the red roses. I need to cut back some of the dead stuff so that we can encourage more growth. <laughs> All right, let's go back over here. Lemon balm is looking good. It's just smelling good. I did cut it back a few weeks ago because it was like crazy. And so you can see where I cut it back. We're getting new leaves. All right, here's my grow bags with my potatoes. The 
This is a purple potato. This is just um, a regular like white potato. And then I did plant some russets over here, but it's not doing as well. So anyways, so here's my new little garden bed where I planted some tomatoes and some of my peppers that I grew from seed. And then I have some oregano that I got yesterday and some basil that I got and planted out. It's already getting eaten by who knows what. <laughs> uh, so anyways, um, all of our jasmine is already dying back. There are a few more, like you can see right here. There are a few more that are going to open, but for the most part, it's already dying back. And my citronella is blossoming. So that's fun. Oh, look, there's another little baby in here with all the other <laughs> things in here. Great myrtles trying to grow. And then last is my wheelbarrow of succulents. And it's looking really good, too. Just had to share. Things are looking good here in the front and I'm expanding since I had so many extra seedlings and like I said I might sell some and sell some of my aloes because there's a few little ones that I could pull out here too and put them into pots. So anyways, thanks for hanging out and I'll have a full garden tour in the back. Lots that's going on in the back too. So. Um, just stay tuned and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.